lunch in Clapham so, yeah. it is so cold my nose won't stop running my nose is actually burning it's that cold my hands everything everybody is always obsessed with her and stops her and chats to us about her so Max literally had about six girls swooning over him because they literally match their outfits today we actually don't know what time it is, but I'll let you know what else we get up to. I'm trying to get used to the vlog life.
thought I'd just quickly talk about the place that we went to and the food and everything like that. So it was a PR invite, but I am not being paid or told to do anything. I wasn't told to do any stories. They just wanted to know what I thought of the place. So we went to the Rose and Crown in Clapham. So it's around the corner from Clapham station and then you get to like these two separate roads and it's like in the middle. It's called like the Polygon, like two Polygon Street. Anyway, I'll leave the information down below because I would 110% recommend and I'm going to book it for when Max's family come back down and any other like dinners or like anything like that that might spur the moment like oh let's go for dinner I'm gonna suggest that to everybody it was so good the vibes were like so chill it's not like um hostile or quiet like everyone was just having their own conversations it's also dog friendly which is obviously super important to us and there was a cute little king charles spaniel in there adorable um yeah 100 percent recommend if you go on a sunday just get the roast you don't need anything else you don't need any sides you don't need any starters you don't need anything else just get the roast max and i struggling i can barely even breathe <laughs> i'm so full um yeah i would 100 percent recommend if you live in south london or live in clapham tooting balham etc surrounding areas highly highly recommend or even if you're coming to visit london and clapham is a place on your list i would definitely recommend clapham for a like sunday walk so you'd go and a nice long walk around the park is huge and it like takes you up to clapham south and then you can just do like a massive loop it's a really nice walk um and then you can go to the rose and crown for your early lunch for your lunch slash early dinner and yeah i would highly recommend the server was so lovely so attentive so nice um and I know you might be thinking like, of course she's going to be attentive and nice to you, but she was exactly the same with every other person in there and not everyone in there was there on a PR invite. Everybody, it's literally just, it was like a really nice family, then some like younger girls, I'm saying younger girls because I'm 27 next month and it makes me feel sick. Um, but yeah, like the vibes were really nice, a really nice Sunday chill if you're hungover it's a good vibe because there's no noise to like give you a piercing migraine but yeah i would 100 percent recommend i'm so full i won't be needing any dinner you could do that between two people and then do a roast if you are like one of those people that just likes to try more things on the menu but I would highly, highly recommend. The other table had, I was like being, I'm always so nosy. I love being placed next to a table that's already ordered so you can see what comes in before you make your order. The fish and chips looked really good and they were very impressed, like they loved everything. Um, yeah, and they even do a um, vegetarian roast dinner as well. Maxwell is back. My battery is flashing, so I just thought I'd quickly show you what we picked up from the car booth. I got these two, what would you even call them? They're just books of prints from the artist, so you can either like take out the prints and frame them, or I'm just going to have them as coffee table books for the moment. I might repurpose them differently when we move but these were two pounds each i wish i actually got more of these but i got these two i then got these gray armani suit pants for 50p and then max got two pairs of trousers for 12 pounds mm. they're just classic black like what would you texture what texture would you say these are i don't know like a woven 
a woven texture. They actually aren't flares at all, they're just... That is the end of our little Sunday vlog. I hope you enjoyed. And I will see you in the next one. Ready, Olive?